hey there you guys welcome back to my channel so this video is going to be a little different today um i'm not going to be couponing in a store i'm just going to kind of be sharing with you guys all of the rebate apps that i use and what i personally think about them which ones are my favorite which ones are my least favorite and things like that so this is something that you're interested in um because maybe you're new to couponing and you want to know what apps will be the best for you because i know not everybody wants to do every app because you know it could be a little bit confusing or it's just too much it's just too much because I, I do get that a lot from people when they ask like oh how do you coupon oh I don't have time for all of that I just so this video would be for you if you're trying to um, get into couponing and you just kind of want to take things slow and what is easier so one of my um, many many apps that I have is inbox dollars i have had inbox dollars and my points since i was like 16. they were one of the first first um rebate apps well back then it wasn't even an app i just kind of went on the computer and um you know signed up and back then they had like videos and things like that now with all this smartphone technology it has become an app so that is one of my favorite apps because um, everything is kind of in one spot so if you're new and you're just looking for something to in like one spot that is good because inbox dollars offers um, coupons like from coupons.com you don't have to print them you just scan your receipt and um, it'll find it in the receipt and give you the cash back for that but it does take about two to three days for you to get the coupons.com coupons cash back once you hit ten dollars on inbox dollars then you can go ahead and cash it out for a gift card or to paypal also with inbox dollars they have um special promotions so it'll be like like right now they have febreze not febreze i'm sorry fabuloso you can purchase two of the smaller bottles of fabuloso and you'll get three dollars back now that is an inbox dollars promotion you'll get that back instantly or if you only want to buy one you'll get back a dollar that you'll get back instantly and then you can also stack that in case if there's like a coupon down there you can um redeem with that but as of right now there is not <laughs> so that is one of my favorite ones right now i have it downloaded in my phone as an app so i can just click on it when i'm in the store and scroll through it and things like that so that is one of my favorite ones because it's all in one area now if you don't want to um have to go through your list and clip your items because you do have to clip them it doesn't matter with inbox dollars if you click it, click clip it i'm sorry before or after you purchase it as long as you have it clipped when you're ready to scan that receipt if you don't want to have to worry about clicking on items and things like that then fetch would be one of your best bets i do enjoy fetch as well um fetch is another rebate app you just kind of take your receipt you can take any receipt for fetch you can take a Publix receipt you could even take a restaurant or a gas receipt and you scan it you'll get a base of 25 um, points for each receipt that you um, submit which is like the equivalent of maybe like two cents for every receipt but they have um, certain brands that they are partnered with, like Dove, they're partnered with Dove, they're partnered with Colgate, they're partnered with um, Huggies, they just have so many partners. And sometimes these partner brands will have special promotions or special deals going on. Like right now for Colgate, you spend $15 in Colgate, they'll award you 1500 points which is kind of like a dollar and 50 cents maybe like a dollar and 20 cents because um depending on what gift card you want depends on the the amount of points that you that you have to spend and they vary so that's why i'm saying like it's like a, a variation but 1500 points for purchasing maybe 15 dollars in colgate and with fetch you don't have to go through anything and clip anything you just take a quick picture of your receipt and boom you get the points so that's really really easy for somebody that might not have time to um you know be going through the phone every day looking for new deals and things like that um you just scan it and if it's there you get it and if it's not there then you just get the base of 25 um po points also, they have um, like a little game you can play. It reminds me of kind of like the casino. 
you scan your receipt and you can click on a little button and it'll scroll and whatever it lands on that'll be like some extra points so that differs every day depending on what you land on so it's pretty cool i like fetch one of the other um apps that i use i use a lot of apps <laughs> and it's really good to use multiple apps because that's how you get the most savings because sometimes one app will have a sale on something and another app will have um another rebate back on it and you can combine both rebates and get you know more of your money back but another app that i enjoy is um ibotta ibotta is really cool um you kind of just it's another one though that you have to scroll through it you have to click or clip the item that you want to re have a rebate for but i enjoy ibotta because if you don't have time like i said to be scrolling through everything and you're just kind of shopping in the store and you want to see if there's a rebate back on it you have the option to scan the barcode and if ibotta has a rebate back on it it'll pop up for you boom you don't have to scroll and keep going and going and going you just scan the barcode and it'll pop up you clip it you buy it you scan your receipt and you get your money back that's pretty easy with um i bought it though once you have to once in order for you to cash out to paypal you have to have at least twenty dollars to cash out to your paypal but you can you can stack up pretty quick with that because a lot of the rebates will be like a limit of five so it's something that you are going to use regularly and it's a really good deal you can go ahead and max it out get all five and then sometimes they even reset so you could go back to the store like the next day and buy it again if it's an item that you know that you're going to use or if it's just a really bomb deal and you still don't know you're going to use it and you can just stock it up in the closet somewhere and use it as you know as you need um so yeah that in my bada is pretty good now if you are somebody that's looking just to make a couple extra dollars a week um, or maybe a month really this will probably be a month and you don't want to buy anything or spend anything shop kicks is the way to go shop kicks i loved when um i was like a stay-at-home mom at one point in time when my boys were really really small i loved shop kicks because if i wanted like if i knew something was coming up and i wanted a couple extra dollars all i had to do was go to the store i didn't have to buy anything i just had to go to the store and scan items so I would spend like my morning sometimes, um, I go to Walmart because Walmart usually or still does, it has the most scans available. And sometimes those scans are like in the thousands. So I would go to Walmart and I'd walk around in the morning, you know, I'd stroll my son around and it was a great way just to get out of the house because if you're a stay at home mom with a young one, I do, I understand that sitting in that house all day, I guess it, you go a little crazy <laughs> so being able to get out of the house and kind of just stroll him around the store and look around and scan my items and i'm making a couple like you know a couple dollars for scanning the items for shop kicks you need about 255 kicks to equivalent to a dollar so we would go around and scan a couple items and then you know we get some cash back and um we you know cash it out to paypal also um you can buy items as well and you will get more money back if you buy an item but if you don't want to purchase anything or spend any money out of your pocket you just look in there just to make a couple dollars shop kicks would be the way to go um with shop kicks you don't have to click anything you just purchase the item um and you go to submit receipt and you click i guess you do have to click <laughs> you click on the item that you purchase you scan the receipt and you wait about a day or so and they will give you back your shop kick points i'm sorry you guys i'm gonna turn the ac on i'm sweating in here it's hot i'm waiting for my kids at school right now um but yeah shop kicks is a way to go if you're not looking to spend any money but you're just looking to make some money and if you use my referral link for any of these apps that i told you about you will get a bonus like i think shop kicks um, last time i checked i think it was like 500 points so kind of like two dollars um a two dollars bonus if you use the referral link i bought a as giving back a bonus uh fetch gives back like another two dollar bonus they all vary sometimes fetch gives back more depending on if they feel like it or not <laughs> but um another one that i use it's not my favorite but i do have it on my phone is checkout 51 they do have rebates back on it like i just utilized it the other day i just utilized it the other day at walmart for fabuloso um i 
I bought not I bought a inbox dollars was giving back five dollars for purchasing um, the big fabuloso for purchasing two of those and then I bought a this is an example of stacking your rebate apps I bought a was giving back another 75 cents for each one so I purchased two of them got back the five from inbox dollars got back 75 cents twice so got back another dollar and 50 cents from Ibotta and then checkout 51 was giving back I think like another dollar 50 or so for for each one so I got like another um three dollars back there so that was a total of eight not nine dollars and fifty cents back for the fabuloso so that's an example of having multiple rebate apps and stacking them or combining them to get the best bang for your buck or to you know get most of your rebate back but I do use Checkout 51. It does have some good um, good things there. Not, I don't see them very often there, but they are there. Um, and then another one that I use is Receipt Hogs. Receipt Hogs, they don't really give you any special promotions or anything like that. You don't have to buy anything special. You just kind of scan your receipts. You can scan any receipt like that you want, like fetch. You can scan restaurant receipts, gas receipts, whatever receipt that comes into your hands. You can scan it. And they give you a certain amount of points or um, coins depending on how much money you spent on the receipt. Some receipts you won't get any coins, you'll get like raffle tickets or something like that. And then um, if you scan a receipt every week for the month, you get um, a certain amount of spins, kind of like the casino again, a certain amount of spins, you pull the liver and it spins and then whatever you get is extra, po extra coins. And then um, also depending on your purchases, you might get lucky enough to get a few surveys. Like I just did two surveys today and got like a, I think it was like a little over 200 coins. And then for every thousand coins you get is $5. You can cash out to PayPal, Amazon, things like that. I cash all of my rebate apps out to PayPal. I don't want a gift card. I want my money back. I mean, gift cards are like money. You can go to the store, but I want cash money where I can go anywhere. I don't want to go to the specific store. So I do everything to PayPal and all of those have offer PayPal. So as a refresher, I almost forgot you guys, I have so many rebate apps that we I do utilize. Um, what is it? Brands, Brands Club, that's what it is, Brands Club. But you can only use it at certain realtors like Walmart and Target, Chewy, Amazon. But you download that app, you um, submit your receipt. Well, you don't have to submit your receipts. You don't have to submit anything, you just, log in with your um information like you log into walmart.com on their web on their app and then it'll sync you hit the sync button it'll sync to walmart amazon uh, chewy all of those whatever you log into it'll find items that you purchase regularly you and then it'll give you like a couple cents back unless you do the surveys um sometimes it'll give you surveys service can come from like a dollar to a dollar fifty things like that and then when you buy that item again and you sync it you will get that amount of money to the survey back I almost forgot about that one that one is pretty cool in the beginning I loved it but now that I've um, bought you know the same items constantly I don't get those same surveys anymore but I still get something back in money is money right and you need about ten dollars to cash out to your PayPal with that one um you guys I have fetch if you just want to scan the receipt and go you don't want to have to clip anything um shop kicks if you don't want to have to spend any money or buy anything that's really cool too you can scan items and you also it's you know you can buy stuff as well um ibotta if you want you know cash back on items that you purchase but you don't want to have to be bothered with scrolling and writing everything down you just kind of scan what you're gonna buy and be done with it and see if there's an app at uh, rebate back there um inbox dollars if you kind of want everything to be in one in one area inbox dollars is pretty good um check out 51 is all right and oh i forgot one shop mia shop mia is like coupons.com pretty much they have coupons you scan you you scan your receipt and you get back there but the thing with them is the, the item has to be clipped before you actually buy it but it's similar to inbox to Ibotta in the way that you can just kind of scan the barcode and if there's a, a coupon for it, it'll pop up. So that one's really easy as well. And with that one, I like it because I don't have to get to a certain threshold before the money will end up in my PayPal account. It'll automatically go to my PayPal account. So even if I just get 50 cents, that 50 cents is gonna go back to my PayPal account usually within 24 hours. 
so yes <laughs> it sounds like a lot it sounds like maybe too much to some people but that is what I do those are all of my rebate apps um, so sometimes I can get money back on items and it'll make my item totally free or it can make my item a money maker where it's like the store is paying me or these apps are paying me back all this money to the point where it makes the item free and I'm making like 10 cents or sometimes even like a dollar or more on just grabbing an item off of a shelf I love those deals those are my favorite favorite deals money maker deals um so if you stuck around to the end thank you so much and if you have not subscribed yet and you think my content is pretty cool go ahead and subscribe what are you waiting for and also give this video a big old like because it's free and it would really mean the world to me if you like this video also it helps youtube's algorithm to let them know that i'm not posting crap i'm actually posting something that people might like and i'll see you all on the next one bye